Hey, what's up everybody? It's your girl Pretty Major. And as you guys can see, the quality of my video is so much better. Finally, finally. I recently got the... Oops, wrong way. The Canon Rebel T4i. Um, I was debating between the D5200, the Canon T3i, and the Canon T4i. Now, I got the Canon T4i solely based on the touchscreen. Me, personally, having an iPhone, having an iPad, always touching, touching, touching the screen made me realize that I just need a touchscreen in my life. I went to Best Buy and started playing around with the cameras and always found myself trying to touch the screen. And I just didn't really want a camera that couldn't do that because I was going to be highly pissed if I was hitting that screen for, like, no reason. It also does have continuous autofocus and video but it's awfully noisy and I really can't stand the noise I don't have an STM lens I actually just got the standard kit lens it's an 18 to 55 millimeter lens um the STM lenses are I believe the 40 millimeter pancake lens and the 18 to 135 millimeter lens and they're expensive so I really didn't want to go buy one I don't really use continuous autofocus anyway I use manual focus I think that it is so much better um I'm going to turn on the um autofocus so that you guys can hear okay so you can hear that that sound as it follows my face so yeah um i'm excited i'm ready to do more makeup tutorials more outfit of the day because i know i haven't did an outfit of the day in forever and a lot of people were asking me to do one because i know that last haul that i did i haven't even worn those clothes yet i honestly like they still have tags on them and that's the reason why i like this shirt right here the paris is for lover shirts never wore it tags still right here from forever 21 like i really I really need to wear it. But yeah, just tell me what you guys think. The lighting isn't that great. I'm sitting in front of my big window in my closet and the sun's not out right now. So um, that's why it's not as bright. I also do have it in manual mode. On the T4i, they switched it to where um, the video mode is not on the little twisty top where you usually like change it. It's on the same part as the on and the off switch. So you just push it all the way up to the video mode. This way when you use the switch, you can do um, creative mode or you can maybe not creative mode, but you can do different modes, landscape mode, portrait mode in video and you couldn't do that in the video um, on the T3i. You had to either use video or you had to use um, the other functions only for pictures. Yeah. This is the lighting if I have it in manual mode. Now if I switched it to auto it would change the lighting completely and I would just look brighter. So I'm going to change it to auto mode. Okay so now it's in auto mode and as you can see I'm not as yellow as I was before when I had it in manual mode. and. When it's in auto mode, it basically tracks the light. It just, it's just so much better. So tell me what you guys think. Tell me how you feel about lighting, manual mode versus auto mode. Which one do you like better? Do you want me to be a little more yellow tinnish or do you like the white balance on this one? Um, just let me know. I'm just really excited to shoot more videos for you guys. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Comment, rate, and subscribe.